follow this tutorial to learn how to install 64-bit versions of PHP on Windows in your PC. XAMPP is a lightweight, easy-to-install bundle that will allow you to do local development on websites in case you don't have a server hosted already. XAMPP consists of three main tools that you need to know when starting web development. They are Apache Web Server, PHP, and MySQL. The Apache Web Server allows you to host your websites or any other content for that matter. Apache is available for UNIX as well as Windows. Some of the most common server-side languages supported by Apache are PHP, Python, and Perl. It is free of charge. PHP is a server-side programming language which is used to produce dynamic web pages. PHP code can be embedded within HTML. It is also free and platform independent, which means that it can be installed on any operating system. MySQL is the world's most popular open source database. It is a relational database management system, RDBMS. Data and its relationships are stored in the form of tables that can be accessed by the use of MySQL queries in almost any format that the user wants. So this concludes your getting to know XAMPP portion. In my next post, I will be talking about how to install XAMPP on 64-bit versions of PHP on Windows. 1. Download XAMPP Go to www.google.com and search Download XAMPP. 2. Install XAMPP When you're done downloading the file, double-click on it to install and then drag the XAMPP folder to your Applications folder. 3. Complete XAMPP installation. All right, so our basic XAMPP installation is complete. When you go to Applications, you'll see a folder by the name of XAMPP. There will be some folders inside. Let's not worry about those for the moment. However, you will see something with the name of Apache Control. This is the console which we will use to start and stop services for XAMPP. And fifth, start PHP servicing. On the console, you will see three basic options, Apache, MySQL, and FTP. PHP is installed in the background and you don't need to start it like other services. Mainly we'll be dealing with Apache and MySQL, so we'll start with those. So services have started and it's time to test them. Go to your favorite web browser like Chrome, Firefox, Safari, or Internet Explorer and go to localhost. This is what you'll see. That's it for this video on how to install 64-bit versions of PHP on your Windows PC. This was a howtech.tv tutorial. Thanks for watching.